Hello, in this tutorial, I'll show you how to adjust, export, and download settings in Canva. I'm going to show you an amazing trick that's going to blow your mind. <laughs> all right, so here's it. Right here from this homepage, all you need to do is to head over to your designs. So let's click on any design that's going to take us to the editing suite. All right, so I'm opening up this design. So it's going to take me to the Canva editor. Here's my Canva editor. So from here, let's see how we can adjust, export, and download settings in Canva. All right, so let all of these elements load up and I'm gonna show you what to do next. So from here, head over to the top right corner of your screen. Mm, top right corner, it seems like we're going out of Canva, right? Yeah, that's what it actually means. So right here, you have this three dots menu, the Canva menu, so just click on that, which is actually next to your, um, Accounts, your Google accounts, just right here where the tab is. All right, this search bar is. So click on this drop down menu. So here, scroll the way down until you find. Um, so go over here, you're gonna find settings. So here are settings. So click on settings. So this is pretty much taking to your Chrome settings. <laughs> Now head over to the left corner. Here you find your and Google autofill password and all of this. So head over to downloads. So open up downloads and now it says downloads. Now this is the location. Now this is where all your designs head over to from Canva. Mm, yeah. So you can definitely change it from here. So go ahead and click on change. And once you click on change, you're going to see an option now to choose where you want to, you know, get your designs to. So let's say I want them to be in download. So I'm just going to click on downloads. All right. And I'm going to click on select folder just right here at the bottom. So you see it has been moved to downloads. You can also change it to, let's say you want them to be in documents and select folder and turn documents. But I don't want to forget. So I'm just going to take it back to downloads because it's preferable. All right, it's I prefer this. All right, it's much easier to find. Now it says ask where to save each file before downloading. All right, so if you want to toggle this on, it means where you want to download anything on Canva. All right, you're gonna to have to ask where you want to save each file. All right, so that you're gonna take it to an automatic place where you do not know. <laughs> All right, and they have show downloads when they are done. You can toggle this or you can toggle it off, but then this is just where the settings are and everything has been changed, right? So remember all the settings. Now let's head over to Canva. So I'm going all the way back and taking it back to Canva. You know, taking it back to my editor. So this is it. Let's say I am deleting this and I want to, of course, download this. So head over to share, click on share and the next thing is download. So I'm going to click on download and PNG fine. So click on download. So you see this is downloading. All right. All right. So if you download, all right. So now it has downloaded. Now they're telling me to show, to tell them where it can be saved to. And this is just really nice. All right. You can even change the file name right here. Let's say. A sweet file and I'm saying save image type as of course PNG. All right, and then hide folders. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so I'm gonna change, I'm gonna select the folder. So let's say I'm selecting the folder to download. So that's where I want it to be. All right, so I click on save and you see it's the same to download. So head over here to this. You're gonna see that has been saved. So I guess I, I'm gonna resume this. All right, so done and also head over to download right there in your system folder you're gonna see that it will be in that exact place you saved it to by right? that exact folder or that exact location that's location now is the right word that exact location so this is pretty much how you can adjust export and download settings in canva now can go and try from top to bottom to get acquainted with the steps so once you're done you'll be good to go i hope this video marvelously